when the Chancellor opened the Heart and Cancer Center, his key aspiration was that we would have a research program at AKU Nairobi. We have a clinical studies unit, which is probably the best in the country, as good as any in the U.S. Roche Pharmaceuticals felt like we could do this clinical trial very efficiently and compliantly. This was the first therapeutic trial in COVID pneumonia in the whole of East Africa. AKU was the premier site to contribute. It means first that a major pharmaceutical company has trust in Kenya to do clinical research. It also means that within Kenya, we as AKU stand out to be a center of excellence that can be depended upon to do this kind of clinical research. Roche Pharmaceuticals chose us because of our capability with the clinical research unit. We have a very strong clinical investigator, Dr. Ina Shah, who's a principal investigator. So the entire team at AKU was premier. The only other site was South Africa. So there were only two sites in Africa, the AKU site in Kenya and the South African site. We enrolled 10 patients. The South African site enrolled six patients. So we clearly were leading in enrollment in the entire African continent. The clinical trials involved patients with COVID-19 pneumonia who were on oxygen, so they had to be oxygen dependent. They did not have to be on ventilators. In fact, you could not be on a ventilator. And the objective was to avoid patients getting onto a ventilator, which is a very morbid condition. The study lasts 28 days. That's the observation period. Patients get one dose of the study agent or placebo. As I said, two thirds of the patients receive study agent a third received placebo, but everybody receives best practice care. At 28 days, we assess, did patients get worse? Did they get better? Did they get home? Or did they have to go into the ventilator? Those are the endpoints of the trial. So we have clearly the knowledge, the expertise, and the patient populations. And that sets us apart from any other academic center or any other center in East Africa or Sub-Saharan Africa for that matter.